Good evening to you and thanks for joining us here on Weekend Edition. I'm Chris Rogers. It's a time honored tradition that has been carried out for more than a decade. This year was no different. The Central Texas community gathered again in the cold this morning to honor the fallen at the Central Texas State Veterans Cemetery. But this year's event truly highlighted what makes this tradition so special. As a grieving woman and a decorated Major General shared a moment finding a common bond over the hero they tragically lost in the carnage of the Iraq War. Channel 6 News reporter Andrew Moore is in studio to tell us how this local tradition birthed a truly heart-wrenching meeting. Andrew. Chris, every year the community comes out to lay a wreath on each grave in the Veterans Cemetery in Colleen. And then in January, they pick those wreaths back up. But this year, an unlikely meeting made one family's grief just a little bit easier. His soldiers were going and they needed him there. And so he went and then he didn't get to come home. Carrie Pierce lost her brother-in-law, Captain Christopher Petty, in 2006. He was killed in Iraq. So in November, she laid wreaths to honor him and other soldiers at the Central Texas State Veterans Cemetery. Freedom isn't free, and we have to appreciate that, and we have to say our thank you. Today, she joined with others to retrieve those wreaths, including Major General John Thompson, the Deputy Commanding General of Three Corps. We can't ever take freedom for granted. And uh, but there's a heavy toll for that freedom. He also served several years in Iraq and lost plenty of soldiers along the way. But little did either of them know one of those faces was someone they both had loved. Yeah, yeah, my brother. He He did. He's captain. That's major. Oh my gosh. Hi. He's awesome. We all loved him. Oh, yeah. We still do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and they never would have met had it not been for a tradition, a wreath, and a photograph. I was come out here and look at this picture. And, mm -hmm. and now every time Pierce comes back to that cemetery, she'll have a new memory. Thank you so much. The brother-in-law she lost, and the major general who lost him too. Volunteers picked up around 8,000 wreaths at the cemetery today. To see the full conversation between Major General Thompson and Carrie Pierce, go to KCENTV.com. Chris? All right, Andrew, thanks so much.